I always coached. When I was a, a young kid, I started coaching at age 14 and uh, and always uh, was involved in kind of analyzing the game and trying to understand how to be successful as an individual player. And that really translated well into being a coach. And so I started young. Um, you know, then I came to Syracuse, got to play for Coach Simmons, who truly inspired me. And uh, you know, and then kind of fell into an opportunity with the women uh, down at the University of Maryland and loved it and stayed with it and here I am. I usually stop by the office, um, just, you know, last minute prep for practice and then we uh, do a morning practice. We practice 8.30 every morning and uh, from practice uh, usually the coaches will go and uh, analyze practice, talk about the next game, lunch every day. And then we're back in the office getting work done. We have lots of projects going from raising money to build a new locker room to preparing for games to travel. There's lots to do. We try to stay upbeat in practice, you know, as much as possible, keep it energized, uh, keep the players focused, and, uh, you know, we, we work off being positive, driving each other to be better. As you you know, we're modern. It's just uh, an honor to be back and be working here. And, and you know, I just have true uh, passion for being an Orangeman excited my daughter's here and as a part uh, you know loves and she loves being here and being a part of it as well so it's just been an incredible experience and it's uh, you know just a great opportunity you know that's certainly our goal and it's been my goal since I've been here and it, it would be uh, an honor and, and uh, to be able to be that that team that delivered the first national championship for Syracuse University in women's athletics so uh, certainly a focus and uh, you know, we're going to get there. It's going to happen. One, two, three, two.